While I openly admit that cold bacon is something I'm a huge fan of, swine flu? Not so much. Hey! Welcome to episode number 131 of The Langel Show. My name's Brian Langel and this thing's hard to breathe in. So how's everybody doing? I'm doing relatively well myself. No signs of any sort of cold, cough, or flu, so I'm pretty sure I'm okay. After all, you know, I spent 15 days under siege last time. I really, really don't want to go through that shit again. So remember back to January when I gave you guys an update on things that I wanted to accomplish this year? I, I think the people that actually take them seriously refer to them as resolutions. Yeah, we're four months into 2009, figured I'd give you an update on how it's going. The first update was, was that I wanted to get below 200 pounds and let's face it, <laughs> that's not happening. Truth be told, I shouldn't, I shouldn't lie. Um, I've lost four pounds, which works out to roughly a pound a month, which means to put my ass on the biggest loser. I showed you those guys how it's really done. They've got some things that I don't have, like trainers and weight rooms and, you know, uh, professional help on how to lose weight. And then to make it fair, I have things that they don't have, like cheeseburgers and chicken wings and milkshakes and, and the such. So I guess it all kind of depends. It's all give and take here, right? The second thing on the list was going to Boston this summer. And as we all know, the Boston gathering kind of disintegrated and got amalgamated in this thing called 789 and put into New York City. And as we also know, I have stated that I'm not attending that now. And I'm doing it because of the responsible thing where I just can't, you know, pour a boatload of money into this trip to New York and go and hang out. Despite the fact that I'd love to. I'd love to go to New York. I'd love to hang out with you guys. You know, whatever they're planning for, like, the daily events, not really my thing. I'd rather, you know, get drunk in a bar or a hotel bar and hang out with some YouTubers. That was more what I wanted to do. So the third thing I want to pull off this year was reach 250 episodes of The Lantel Show as of New Year's Eve, which really is a great idea and I would love to do it, but unfortunately this whole an episode every three days pace really isn't working for me. So I'm going to call an audible. As you guys know, I'm busy. I mean, I've got The Lantel Show, I've got Team Langel, I've got the Festival of Lights and Rock Talk going on, so I'm really kind of busy and I can't really dedicate the amount of time I'd like to. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to drop it from episode 250 on New Year's Eve to episode number 200. I, I think that's a fair trade-off. I mean, 70 episodes of Langel, 70 all-new episodes of Langel? Who can go wrong with that, right? And the fourth thing that I wanted to accomplish this year was I wanted to reach 200 subscribers on YouTube. And as of right now, the end of April, we're actually at 192. That's right, we're eight subscribers away from reaching the goal of 200 subscribers for the entire year. I mean, I feel like it's a telephone. Like, roll the numbers, Charlie. We're at eight subscribers away, and I want to take a second and thank you guys because that is absolutely amazing. So how are we doing, guys? I mean, that's the wrap-up. I mean, we're, we're, we're still losing weight, so we're doing good with that. I might have to skip a meal or two or a month or two or something like that, but we'll figure that out. Uh, I'm not going to New York, so I'll call that one a fail, but I really have a feeling we'll all get together some other time, and that'll be awesome. Um, we're changing it from 250 episodes to 200, but I mean, who can complain about 70 all new original episodes, right? So that's going to be a win. And the 200 subscribers thing, I really think is going to happen. I think you guys have that totally in control, and I can't wait for it. So, you know, that's all I'll go. I'd say things are all looking good in the world of Langel. Anyway, I'm going to wrap this one up. Thank you for watching episode number 131 of The Langel Show. You can check me out at thelangelshow.com and youtube.com. You can follow me on Twitter, twitter.com slash langel, and dailybooth.com slash langel, which I just posted a new photo on. So you have to check that out. And there's this little thing called Blog TV. You guys know the deal. It's it's like 8 o'clock Eastern, 9 o'clock Atlantic, 5 o'clock Pacific, 1 a.m. GMT on Friday nights. Uh, no idea what's going to come up, but we'll talk about something. In the meantime, that's my report card. I give myself a B plus because, you know, it's all about B plus. Take care.